All right. So in this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to save your finished drawings as a PDF with multiple pages, and then how to hand that in. So at this point, uh, you should have all of your drawings done, uh, drawings one to six. And unlike me, you should have six tabs down here with drawing one, two, three, four, five, six, all done and dimensioned in order. So when your assignment's done, you'll have your views, um, the correct layers assigned, all of your dimensions put on, your notes, and your title block is filled out. And as you can see, my title block's not done. I still have to fill in the date and revision number. When you hand this in the first time, your assignment will always be revision one. Um, if you have to resubmit for any reason, then you would change it to revision two or three or, or whatever. Um, and then your first sheet is going to say sheet, in this case, one of six. Your second sheet will see sheet two of six, three of six, like six of six, that kind of thing. So once all your six pages are done and you have them in order, here I, I don't have them in order, so you'd have to you know, move them around, um, you are going to export it as a PDF. So you do that uh, by going up to the big A, export PDF. When you do this, you want to pick where it's going to be saved. Right, Mine's going into my examples and demos because this is a demo. And I'm going to call this drawing, <coughs> drawing uh, 1 to 6. And that's what this is for hand and You don't need to put your name in the title or anything, just drawing 1 to 6. And then what's important over here is you make sure it's selected as an AutoCAD PDF. Um, also that it should default to this. And that you're not exporting just the current layout, you're exporting all of your layouts. So that's how you get all of your pages saved into one PDF. So then you go save, and then it should come up with a little message that your plot and publish job is complete. And then you can check your folder where you told it to save. So I have this drawing one to six. I'll open it up. So I've opened it with Adobe Acrobat. And I can see here, right, I have my, my two sheets. They show here sheet one and two. You should have six sheets all in order with your name and your title block filled out. This is a good time to check it to make sure it plotted properly. You don't have any borders jumping off the page. You don't have any errors, no missing layers. Everything is good. And what's cool about this, when I go to the layer feature, is I can see that you've done your layers properly, right? So if I turn off title block, your title block should go off. If I turn off hidden, your hidden line should go off. So this is how I can check that you've done your assignment properly. This is also where I'll mark your assignment um, is going to be in Adobe Acrobat. So once you have it done, uh, you have your all six sheets on here. Uh, you're happy with how it looks. Everything looks good. Um, then you can hand this in. So to hand it in, you're going to log into your MyEdBC account, and then you'll see that there are options to hand in the assignments. One of the assignments is going to be, you know, drawing one to six, and then you just click and drag your assignment in, and then it shows up on my end. Um, I actually see it right in my grading window. I can click your assignment, and I can mark it, um, you know, hand it back to you, and pu put a mark into your MyEdBC account. Uh, so that's it. That's all you have to do. If you have any questions, please come ask me.